Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play SimCity 4 with me, Xbox. Uh, I'm going to do a short video here. A super short video. This is just going to be your basic tutorial on um, city resources, sharing city resources, and uh, problems that can come uh, from doing so. So here we have just a small city, and I'll show you uh, a couple of things. The first thing is how to share water. This one's pretty straightforward. Uh, most people will know. The most important thing is that you draw the pipe straight to the exit here. And when it asks you, you hit accept. And you want to look for this arrow here. That arrow is your visual indicator whether or not um, your region's connected. Power, exactly the same. You want to draw it, make sure it's off, hit accept, and there'll be an arrow there. Roads, same thing. If you don't see that arrow, you're not you're not going to be exporting and importing. So make sure that that arrow is there. Okay. Um, the, to initiate all the deals, it must be actually connected to your um, must be connected on the other side. You can't just have it going nowhere. So you have to come here, and you have to make sure that it is actually connected to your region. So the first thing we're going to look for is the road we have here. You can see that the road here is connected because it has that arrow and so is the power. Now if your power looks like this and it's connected next to a zone then your power will transfer region. Uh, if it's not connected, if there's just blank space here if I if I was to go like this and do zone, okay, this here you can't initiate a power deal if your power looks like that. Your power has to run into onto the street which connect which is connected to zones like that. All right, and then to initiate the power deal, you go to neighborhood deals, and then you can look here and you can be like, we're gonna sell power to new city or water to the new city. Uh, and then uh, for some reason the power is not connected and I think that has to do with uh, the next thing I'll show you. So like for here you want to make sure the pipes are connected. I don't know if that's necessary or if they can just be connected to anywhere that's covered in blue. Um, but yeah, so I want to exit to region and I want to exit without saving. So if you go here, the reason you can't import power is because the power is not actually hooked up to anything. So you have to build a building, okay? And so if you go like, if you build a building, let's go ahead like this and build an office tower. All right. If you build a building like that, once the building's connected to water or to to the power, then you should be able to initiate the, the water deal some reason it's not letting me in. But anyway, so if you hit play, it'll give you the power zod. But this means that your power is connected on both ends. As you can see, our power is connected on both ends. As you can see, power and transport are connected on both ends. So sometimes you have to turn um, sometimes you have to turn cheetah speed on for like a couple of days to initiate the neighboring deals. Hmm. Still doesn't want to export power. It's interesting. Why don't you want to export power? Should be fairly straightforward power exportation. We do need it, so let's take a look here. Deals. Well, there's a good chance that they don't actually have any power to export. That the, that's the next thing we need to check. My guess is that there's no power here that's surplus. That's the other reason. You have to make sure you have enough power to export. We do have enough power to export. Hmm. 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 So I don't know what's going on. But I'm going to... One of the things you can do 
if it's bugging out, which it, it can, is reset up the connection and try again. It still doesn't want to let me export power. So I don't know what possibly could be the problem. <laughs> I mean, the lines are connected and everything's working. Let me try reconnection from here. That's really bothering me. Why won't you? My dog's coming for a visit here. Cause this guy, this neighbor deals uh, set up correctly. Sometimes the neighborhood deals bug out, and you know, it just happens. Well, you know how to do water, anyway. And for power... River's coming for a visit, sticking her nose under my armpit. So, I made the power connection off of an existing grid. Let's see if we can't make this work. It may just be, um... Like a weird little bug with Sunnyvale, that's possible. Yeah, let's take a look here. So my guess is... I'm pretty sure you can't import power without... Oh, well there you go. So I don't know why it didn't work up there. Um, maybe the... Like the farm isn't connected to the grid, or, or there's some bug with like farm territory, but... It really is as simple as... Um, creating this connection except going to your next region and making sure that the power is connected to the grid and then this these like as I showed you before can get cut off really easy so if you're building avenues like this you have to make sure to bring the avenue out no. you have to make sure that your avenue runs like this oh hey look this one worked with one well, the game's just decided to prove everything wrong to me and wrong with everything I've done today. <laughs> um, so that's essentially how you set up neighboring deals. Um, with garbage, to set up a neighboring garbage, you have to have a place that stores garbage or that is moving garbage. So garbage has to be moving in a direction. So um, all of that stuff is it's it's super basic. I, I I don't know what could be causing the problem here, and I don't know what could be causing your problem specifically. But generally speaking, when you set up a neighbor deal, a deal with a neighboring city, you have to have access. So you have to make sure that that arrow's there. You have to have something that's providing. So you have to have power plants, or water plants, or landfills. Then you have to have, it's, it's best to have a transport connection as well. Um, transport connections, transport connections will actually make it so that your city, your traffic can travel, and that'll, tra like, without transport connections, either um, any of these, essentially, without any of those, you won't be... You won't be able to transfer any demand. So if I was to go to, oh, let's see, this city here. If you look at this city's demands, because it's not connected to the map, there's no demands on this region. All it is is your your normal neutral uh, starting position, which is a little bit of agriculture, a little bit of dirty, a little bit of... Low wealth residential and a little bit of low, low wealth commercial. And there will be no neighboring deals because it's completely isolated. Right? So, the first thing usually I do when I build any city is I make a road connection. 
So hopefully that helps clear things up. Um, some of the problems that could arise, I guess I wouldn't rely on farm uh, plots to transfer your power for now. Not really sure why, man, this city's really underdeveloped. Uh, not really sure why that this is creating a problem, but it just is. It might be because of the nature of the power, because it's wind, or maybe some other weird inconsistent uh, reason. Wind power is not the most reliable thing to export anyway. Gen generally speaking, export your power from your um, heavy industrial city mostly because these guys like I'll show you why you don't want to build coal power plants in a city if you take a look like obviously the dirty industrial is contributing to it but these guys they're such heavy polluters same thing with these guys the uh, waste energy plants even at uh, 10 simoleons they'll contribute to just horrible amounts of air pollution and similarly they'll contribute to water pollution as well in in this city the beautiful thing about this city is because nobody lives here there's no like that doesn't matter I'm curious to see how our subways going in this city too I don't know why that's blue though Oh, do I have... <laughs> that must be from a data view or something. Why was it like that? <laughs> I don't know. Alright, well, um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this little mini video. It's mainly, the, the purpose of this video mainly is to establish, um, like, use, like, how to do city deals and how to, um, how to make sure that you're shipping the regional demand to the right places plus initiating city deals so um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed that video and it'll be a super short one it's mainly just um to cover the neighboring deals um i, th I th kind of may have just may have just left that out but who knows We were in New York. This was our original Let's Play, hey? So I guess one of the things I was going to try to show... I guess I'll tack this on as well. So we go to Dartmouth here, which is like one of our earlier cities from my last Let's Play. This this playthrough hasn't been played without mods, and my hope is that the traffic... <laughs> well, I must have cut off the power deal, but my hope is that... Blah, blah, blah. We'll get through all of these clickables and then take a look at traffic. My hope is that the traffic is still going to show... No, it cleaned it up. Mm, that's interesting. So never mind. Let me get rid of that, even though it's <laughs> on camera. This city fucking sweet, by the way. These buildings here. And we have, like, some of these gigantic commercial office towers and stuff like that. The cities, all high wealth. All high wealth. In case you've never watched my last Let's Play. Ah, it's still there. Okay. Anyway, um, so thanks for